now we're going to talk about uh, how we can uh, inspect elements on a web app uh, on your android device so basically uh, the device that you see over here is uh, my actual android device and this is one of the features that uh, is provided uh, by chrome itself but we need to do some configuration in order to uh, show up these fe this feature so i'll be explaining you in detail uh, what i have actually done in order to bring up uh, this feature so if you uh, if you see over here if, see i'm moving my device and uh, it's actually the actual device that is showing over here right and the best part if you click on this inspect element you can actually inspect the elements of your real device if i click on this you can see it is actually showing it has a name as email and same way if i click on uh, this it, it actually brings up the keyboard but uh, you'll not be able to see the view of keyboard but that that's fine i'll uh, click on this and uh, okay i have clicked on that so it has actually uh, what it has done it has actually clicked on that particular link so what i need to do i'll, I'll, I'll go back just give me a moment so again i'm i'm back to uh, the app so again if i want to uh, see the ids of or the, the elements of this login button i'll click on this and it will show me that this login button has a type somewhere value login this is the class and this is the name so I can very easily inspect the element uh, that are there on, on my Android mobile device, right? Now let's see uh, how we can actually uh, um, how we can actually uh, configure this uh, agent, this user agent, and how we can connect our real mobile device. Uh, and this is one of the inbuilt functionality provided by Chrome. So we're going to see this thing uh, in our next lecture. All right.